Wow. I wonder if Salim was trying to see if he could summon a genie for one of these lamps. He must be right. Why, that door definitely... Okay, Sly, you should get out of there and head for the village while... I still need some more data, Sly. Keep searching. You're Salim Al Kapar, aren't you? And who are you? Uh, well, that part's kind of complicated. I'm a thief like you, but I'm kind of new in town. How about you come back to my gang's hideout and I can explain myself? How about you go lick a camel's hump? <laughs> okay. Look, I know you're in trouble. I'm here to help. I can explain everything, but let's go where we can talk safely. Besides, you look hungry. How would you like some food? Food? <laughs> it was foolish of you not to mention that in the first place. Let's go.
Falcon is the lead, and it's obvious that outfit is the key to his success. He claims it was once owned by a real genie, and that it could actually slow time. If it is true that an elephant never forgets, then it is also true that you are an unforgettable elephant. <laughs> yes. Oh, I thought you'd never notice. So, so please. Why did you hear that? They're creating a false royal identity for Le Paradox in the present day. If that happens, he'll be close to untouchable. They also need a delivery. The panther needs scorpion claws. Maybe we can make that work for us. Perfect. And I just had my tail shampooed. This desert is just one giant litter box. <laughs> what a delightful day for a stroll. Ah, how lovely to see your heels flapping in the breeze once again, Cherie. <laughs> you should warn me before you do that. <laughs> Cherie, seeing you today has made me realize you are truly one of a kind. Oh, Cyril, you're making me blue. Watch where you're pointing that trunk. Stupid guard. <laughs> Can't even whistle a decent melody. Oh, any more re Boy, I'd hate to be the guy that has to collect the coat. And who is this little pipsqueak? Yes, identify yourself immediately. It's a me, uh, the delivery boy. You are called? Hmm, I don't recognize your scruffy features. The other boys are out to seek uh, something about the snake bites. Is there something wrong with your voice? No, uh, I've been talking like a this my whole life. How droll. I see. Well, if you're really the delivery person, then you would know the usual orders, no? What a food does the panther require? Why the panther loves the scorpion claws? Hmm. He appears to be legitimate. <sighs> Thank goodness. Here are the delivery locations. Hurry up, please. Fly is a good thing we're in Arabia, because in Italy that accent would be considered a felony. Now let's go rescue those thieves!
I wonder if you... This Bentley will have me... Much rather be riding a camel with three humps. A thousand thank yous once again for this most excellent idea. Oh, cobras in baskets! <laughs> the perfect gift! All these blades and traps! Just what an old thief wants to see! At least this lucky fellow is getting some rest. My brother, are you all right? Oh, oh, my head. Where am I? You have been imprisoned, hypnotized, and compelled to create forgeries by that evil elephant. But I have freed you from her mesmerizing music. With, you know, some assistance. That's nice. I'm hungry. Did you bring me anything to eat? Perhaps some nice roasted scorpion tails? Maybe some camel milk? Amazing! I climb halfway to the stars to rescue you, and you expect camel milk? Why do I bother?
Okay, Murray, the thief known as the Tiger is being held inside that taxi shop. My data shows the interior is small, but well reinforced. Also, there don't appear to be any guards inside at the moment. I think this one is pretty straightforward. You and Sly go in through the front door. After that, your muscles should be enough to handle the situation. No problem, Bentley. My mighty biceps are itching to go to work. should take those cannons out first. Concentrate on the target. Go, big guy. I'll meet you on the other side. Oh. I'm nuts. Sharks look as hungry as me. I should take those cannons out first. I'll show those chumps how to use a cannon.
Jeez, those sharks look as hungry as Murray. I think you better step on it, Sly. That ship is starting. That ship is definitely sinking. Get moving. That's David. Who are you? Relax, pal. I'm a friend of Salim's. Oh, Salim. Did he give you anything for me? Like all the money he owes me for betting on the camel races? Uh, sorry. You'll have to take that up with him. I most certainly will. <coughs> Why this is going to get I could drop smoke bombs with the R1 button. All right, Ben Lee, bombs away. Right up target. Oh yeah, right on the button. Direct hit. Nailed it! Talk about a smoke! Speed boost will get me out of trouble! Trump and away! Give me some cover, pal. Air battle! Look out below! I don't smoke about! Bombs away! How do you like them smoke signals? All right, it's go time. Time for the smoke, buddy. Right on target. Nailed it. Air bail. Look out below! Dang it! I will smoke him out! Bombs away! Talk about a smoke break! How do you like that? Them smoke sick! Thank <laughs> you. 
I was being charmed like a snake and could not break free. That was no nightmare, my friend. Salim, you were in my dream too. You brought me many delicious snacks. What is with you guys and all the food? Salim, who is this insolent pup? Oh, don't worry about him. He is a friend who helped rescue you. In fact, he is my assistant. Assistant? What are you talking about? Why? Play along. It's better if less people know what's going on anyway. Great. It's gonna be a long day. Oh, and don't forget what's left of that device slide. I'm almost done with a little invention of my own. <laughs> Thank you. 
Who stacked these books? This place needs a new librarian. Well, this climbing is going to turn me into a monkey. Ah, these chains would not hold a meerkat. Good job, Salif. One down, two to go. have any good cookbooks in here. These chains break so easily. Maybe I need to go All right, diet. just one more transmitter. Yes, yes, enough. there is always one more thing with you, is there not? Why did my skin have to be climbing? Why not sleeping? Oh, 
This is their worst undercover assignment ever. Goodness, Interpol will never know about this. Someday I will get Betty back for this. Cooper gang members does it take to open a door? Sly, I am thinking I should go no further. I have passed my greatest wisdom on to you. The last of my friends are now retired, and I have had enough snakes and scorpions and climbing for three lifetimes. Besides, I was thinking someone should watch over Carmelita to make sure she is safe. All right, Salim. We couldn't have made it this far without you, but I think we can handle it from here. You've definitely earned your retirement. Go enjoy it. And the belly dancing. Thank you. I will. expecting an underground docking station for La Paradox's blip. No wonder we haven't seen that thing floating around. So what's our next move, Bentley? Well, first we need something to distract those guards so I can get to that control room. I whipped up a surprise for Miss Decibel with the leftover material from Carmelita's outfit, but I think it might work better here. Finally! Just point me in the direction of the chain. What the? Perfect. I could use the security cameras to guide the RC car. Go, Bert, go!
Control room. Time to show this security. Murray, we can't wait on Bentley. We won't get past those security cannons, and those rat troopers look serious. Murray, remember to use the circle button to stop and pick up things. Use the square button to toss those rats, pal. All right, time to kick some rodent butt. The Murray is a machine. Nailed it, big guy. Nice arm, Murray. <laughs> Hello, Cooper. How do you like my food? Why, those containers look fragile. You'll need to find a way to get across before they break. Look out, This is your funeral march! <laughs> <laughs> The melody is so catchy. <laughs> Look at the time. I don't think either of you is going to make this flight. How beautiful! The tiny rat chasing the big cheese. Face me, and I can deliver it personally. Why are we still here? I knew I should have gotten an early start today. Stupid blimp takes too long to warm up. This is 
your funeral march! <laughs> <laughs> I should have known better than to work as a prophet. They have to remember everything, everything! Never again! Let me in! I don't think so. You see, we have already reached maximum weight capacity. Perhaps due to my beautiful new guest? Carmelita! <laughs> Get your paws off me, you noxious windbag! But we had a deal! I made you the documents, and you promised me the lost masterpieces! Mozart, Beethoven, romantic nights on the Riviera! Yes. Uh, well, thank you so much for my papers, but it wouldn't have worked out between us. I'm just not into big noses, and as for your music... Hmm, how can I put this? It stinks worse than I do! <laughs> Why, oh, you filthy, backstabbing, two-timing scoundrel! <laughs> Flattery will get you nowhere. And as for you, Cooper, don't even think about trying anything. Otherwise, we're going to find out if your girlfriend can fly. I don't see any wings, do you? Touch me again and I'll break both your arms! Sly! Don't worry, Carmelita. This isn't over. Isn't it? In fact, I believe there is a perfect saying for this situation. The fat lady, she has sung. <laughs> Au revoir, Slade Cooper!